This photo was posted with the caption, This is how Alberta Health Services sends mail to my 15-year-old. A letter not addressed to any individual, but rather a status. The woman who posted it lives in central Edmonton. She declined through a friend to speak to CTV News as she feels the photo speaks for itself. There was plenty of reaction at question period. Today we learned about a very disturbing letter. The language is completely inappropriate and it is culturally offensive and it should never have been used. And let me take this opportunity to offer my personal apologies uh, to the person in question who received the letter. AHS is also apologizing and providing a bit of an explanation. Thursday afternoon, it released this statement. The error occurred when historical wording related to treaty status was entered into the wrong field on a patient record at the time of a hospital visit more than a decade ago. Following a more recent hospital visit, our computer system inadvertently copied that incorrect wording and included it on an invoice, which was then sent out to the person. No matter what happened, it shouldn't have happened, and it, we want to ensure that it doesn't happen again. It's not the first time AHS has had to apologize for insensitive language. Just this past June, an AHS employee was suspended after sending a text using a term offensive to Indigenous women. Very clearly, not enough has changed within all aspects of the provincial government. AHS says it will continue to review this case and all language into its billing database to prevent any more patients from being labeled. Dan Grummet, CTV News, Edmonton.